In this video, we are going to explore a fundamental question in structural engineering that's why do we provide cranked bars in beams and slabs? Cranked bars play a crucial role in reinforcing these structural elements and we will illustrate their significance in detail. So let's dive in and understand the key reasons behind incorporating cranked bars in beams and slabs. Imagine a beam or a slab spanning some certain distance subjected to various loads. These loads exert forces on the structure. As a result, the beam will tend to bend in a way that I have shown in this picture. Due to the loading, the member will be subjected to bending moments. There will be positive bending moment or sagging moment at the mid span of the beam and negative moments or hogging moments at both the supports. To counter the sagging of beam at the mid span, we provide reinforcement at the bottom of the beam to withstand the tensile stresses. Conversely, to counter the negative moments at the supports, we place reinforcement bars at the top. However, rather than installing separate bars, we utilize bent up bars to resist hogging at the supports. Cranked bars allow for optimized reinforcement by avoiding the need for separate bars in certain areas. This design reduces the overall amount of reinforcement needed, making the structure more cost effective without compromising on safety. Ultimately, we position these bars within the columns to ensure adequate anchorage. The segment of the bar inside the column is known by the term development length and is denoted by LD, while the inclined length is termed as crank length. The crank length can be calculated by using the formula 0.42D, where D represents the beam's depth minus the clear cover for the top and bottom. As per IS456-2000, the minimum clear cover for beams should be 25 mm varying from 25 mm to 35 mm based on environmental conditions. For slabs, the minimum clear cover should be 15 mm, ranging from 15 mm to 30 mm based on environmental factors. The use of crank bars in beams and slabs serves to resist negative bending moments, manage shear forces which are typically higher at the supports, and optimize reinforcement, leading to cost-effective structures. Are you ready to master the structural design with hands-on experience in real-life projects? Then, I am giving you an opportunity to enroll in our structural mastery course, wherein you will get to work on 6 separate projects including 3 practice models, G plus 1 residential building, G plus 4 commercial building, and an apartment building. The workflow will include ETAB's complete advanced design course, SAFE complete advanced foundation design course, and RCDC complete RCC detailing course. In addition to that, you will get access to the structural drawings and excel sheets for reference. The course is available both in Hindi and English languages with separate playlists. So hurry up and grab this course by applying the coupon ETABS500 to get the maximum discount before the offer goes off air.